Hey everybody, time for a quick little tech tip here. I'm getting ready to fill in the lettering on my timing cover plug for my Royal Enfield. I'm going to use a can of black spray paint, some lacquer thinner, and a wooden rigid sanding block with a piece of cloth on it to remove the excess paint. I've already taken up paint cans on. I will go ahead right quick. One light coat right there for a second. The other thing I've got to mention, I went ahead and put tape around the bottom edges where I don't want any paint to go like on the threads or on the o-rings for the oil seal. So that looks fairly decent so far. We'll spin it around a second. Now, I'm going to give it one more quick little coat. Make sure it's filled in good. I'm going to pause the video for a little bit to load some paint thinner on my lock and I'll be right back to show you. Of course it's very important that whatever block you use to do this with is rigid so that you don't pull the paint out of the bottom of the lettering. I may give this another coat and then wipe it off again. As you can see, as soon as the camera comes back into focus, it actually is very well filled now and it's clean. I'm going to let it dry for a few minutes, then I'm going to peel the tape off the side, put it on the buffer, and shine it the rest of the way up. As you can see here, I have removed the tape. Everything is done very well. I'm going to give this paint a couple more hours to dry. And then I'm going to buff it out and reinstall this part. Just want to polish the aluminum to a nice mirror finish when I get done. But until then, stay crazy. It's really hard work prepping your daily driver for show duty again. Oh well, say la vie. Just make it more fun to ride every day.